Hello friends, welcome back to our channel. So in the previous sessions we have seen uh, the files concept. So how to open a file, how to create a file and how to close a file and what are the different access modes to open a file and uh, uh, what are the reading operations and writing operations. So let us see uh, everything by implementing a simple programs, right? So, so the main advantage of file is to uh, save the output, right? See, let us uh, write the program. So, in order to implement this file, first uh, that can be done by using one file pointer. Let us take f1 as a file pointer. f1 is equal to open sum hello.txt is a file name. I am opening in write mode. Hello.txt in write mode. So, after implementing this one, uh, one uh, I mean the text file has been created and the file pointer points at the beginning of the file. Now, start writing f1 dot write, write the content, so f1 dot write, this write uh, function will take only one argument that is a string. So, whatever the string we have to enter into a file, write into a file that must be written here. So, after executing this, the file, I mean the data has been written. Now, close the file, f1 dot close. So, let us execute and check whether the file has been created with the given text or, or not. <coughs> Excuse me. Hello dot py. Oh, sorry. File one dot py. Now I will execute this one. Run this file. So nothing has been printed, but we have to check whether the file has been created or not. So, now the question is where the file has been created. So, in order to check whether the file has been created or not, just import the OS and write, sorry, OS dot get CWD. So, if you implement this one, we can get the current working directory. That means where these files has been saved. So, G in G Python programs. Now, our file has been created in that particular location. Let us check. In G, there is a folder called Python programs. See, here we can find the text file hello. See, hello.txt. Welcome to Python programming. Just now we have created the file, right? See, right. Now let us uh, read the file. Now again open the file in read mode. Next f1 dot read. So it will read just it will read the data from the file and it will be holded in the buffer. If you write the print function, it will display on the screen. Print f1 dot read. Run this program. Save. So the data has been. I mean that the content which we have, uh, which is available in that particular uh, file, has been printed on the screen. Welcome to Python programming. And if you give the argument five. So, only 5 characters will be printed. Hope you understood this one. Then again, if you print f1 dot read of 4, so 
So, well, W E L C O M E space T because so after executing the first statement, the file pointer is at the sixth position. So, five positions has been uh, written to the screen. And the, uh, the file pointer points to the sixth position. From the sixth position, the four characters will be printed here. So, unless you close the file, the file pointer never goes to the beginning of the file. So, f1 dot close. Right? Now, let us see the multiple lines. New file f1 is equal to open some m lines dot txt w f1 dot sorry lines is equal to give the list welcome give the slash n new character yes. python programming so i have written three statements in a list right now i will write this lines f1 dot right lines of lines then f1 dot close and let us execute this one file 2 execute this one so let us check whether the file has been created with the given text or not. So if you see here m lines dot txt, so three lines has been created. So if you observe here, the three lines has been created, right? Now let us read the same data. Again f1 dot, oh, sorry, sorry, f1 is equal to open m lines dot txt read mode f1 dot read line just i am executing the read line f1 dot so, uh, just i will i will write it in a print so that uh, it will be displayed on the screen So welcome, this is the first line. So if you implement the same thing, so now the file pointer will be in the second line. See, welcome Python, two lines have been printed. If you implement this with the lines, read lines, now everything will be printed. Welcome Python programming the list complete list will be printed right so hope you understood this one now let us uh, try with the append mode if you append one if you open this m line start text in append one append mode and uh, try to uh, write one more line So after executing this one, just we will check in the program itself. So m lines dot txt. So there is the fourth line that is hello. So that means in append mode the file pointer points at the end of the file, end of the content of the file. So whenever you are writing the data, the data will be appended. So without overwriting the old data. 
So the previous data will be remain same and the new data will be appended from the end of that particular file. So if you read it one, f1 is equal to open mlines.txt read mode print f1 dot read f1 dot close so if you write if you execute this one all the complete content will be displayed on the screen so hope you understood this simple uh, files programs so read mode append mode and a write mode and a read read function read line read lines write function and write lines right so if you are having any doubts regarding this files program feel free to post your doubts in the comment section so that i will definitely try to clarify all your doubts and uh, if you really understood my sessions like my sessions share my sessions with your friends and don't forget to subscribe to our channel so thanks for watching thank you very much